You'd be surprised how many people go, oh, no, Lord, I ain't worthy. I just, 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 I, I just, we have to suffer for you, Jesus. Suffer. Just beat me, Jesus. No, he don't want to beat you. <laughs> but he has to make people lie down in green pastures. Is that a man? That, why would anybody have to be made to lay down in green pastures? You ought to be just laying down in the grass or in the snow doing them, what do you call it, the snow angels, just, just enjoying yourself. Why? People get mad at me because I enjoy my life. Why? Because the Lord don't have to tell me, he don't have to make me lay down in green passes. I just sit down. Bless God. Let's have a picnic. God, come on. Let's do something. Because you see, the Lord's my shepherd. I've had people say, he don't worry about nothing. No, I don't. I could care less. I don't care about nothing. You know why? Because care is a form of pride. What? It's a form of pride. You start caring about something, you saying God can't handle your business, so God, you got to take it back from God and worry about it. Don't shout me down when I'm preaching good. Listen to me. So I don't care about nothing because, you see, I cast all my care upon him. When, you, when you've been down in three airplane crashes, you better learn not to care. That's why I bought my own plane. People get mad at me, my God, because I've owned three jets. I'm sorry. I just burned them up for Jesus, yet all three are still in ministry. Isn't that a blessing? About ready to get a fourth. <laughs> just thought I'd tell the media that. Praise the Lord Jesus Christ. Hey! Why? Because I use it for the work of the Lord. Look, Jesse get a day off. He ain't going to Florida. I ain't going to Hawaii. Jesse go home. E.T. phone home. Jesse go home. Because I'm not home very much. So I like being home. I live in a very cultural city. So I enjoy going home. But I'm always working. See? The Lord's my shepherd. So when going down on an airplane, people, I never forget on a commercial airplane. You know, people don't talk about God until they're about ready to lose their life. I had a guy cuss me out, an atheist, on a plane that was going down. He looked at me. I was reading my Bible. Some of you heard me say that. He said, you a preacher? I said, yeah. He said, I don't believe in your blankety-blank God or your blankety-blank Bible. Oh, that made me mad. I said, Jesus, I can take care of this. I come from New Orleans. I'm going to make him an offer. He don't refuse. I was mad. I was mad, I'll be honest with you. And all of a sudden, we got something from the captain. That's when he, it says, uh, uh, fasten, you see about no smoking, please. That's when they used to smoke on planes. And so I did, and I happened to be at the window. I never, I always sat in the aisle seat before I bought an aircraft, you know, always sat in the aisle seat. And this guy was in the aisle seat, and brother, it got rough. And then it got rougher. And then I could begin to hear people go, mm, mm, mm. You know, you start hearing people mumbling, oh, oh, Lord. You see that concerned look on people's faces and stuff like that. And I thought, well, Lord. And all of a sudden, I mean, thunder's getting worse. All of a sudden, lightning hit the jet. They're not, that, you know, it's not grounded, so it shouldn't blow up, but I, it did. <laughs> I don't understand how it did, but it hit that engine, and the engine's on the wing. And then all of a sudden, the engine, boom, bam, blows up and fire. I'm at the wind, I go, oh, oh look at this. <laughs> True story, brother. Brother, that plane, that, that captain took that plane, we had 33,000 feet, and he just nosedived that baby. Here come the oxygen man. He's going down, man. My Lord. And this atheist fool says, oh, God. I said, he don't exist. Enjoy your death. <laughs> I couldn't help it. I had to say it. Was you worried? No, because the Lord is my shepherd. Do you understand that? Now, you can talk about that when everything's going good, but when you're going down an airplane, you better believe the Lord's my shepherd. The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He restoreth my soul. I like that next step. Yea, oh yes, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death. You're not walking in death valley. You're walking in a shadow. How did you get rid of the shadow? Turn the light on. Order your copy today 